Hey, it's Michael and we love our bird feeders. We have four bird feeders out here. And as you can see, they're probably about 15 feet away from where we sit in our family room here. But uh, we get probably at least 10 or 12 different varieties of birds and it's so cool to watch them. But you know, the thing is we have a window right here and wouldn't it be cool if we could get the bird feeder right on the window somehow so that we could really get up and close and personal with the birds. And that's why I'm really excited to try this uh, Nature's Envoy window bird feeder. I'm gonna install it and uh, put some bird seed in there and show you how it works. And maybe we'll even get some birds to visit it in a short period of time. It'll be interesting to see how long it takes for them to find it and start feeding on it. All right, so let's open this up. So these are the suction cups that are going to stick the bird feeder to the window. And there's four of them. And this is just the plastic perch. This tray comes out for easy cleaning. Just lifts up. And you'll notice there's four circular posts which fit into the holes on the bottom of the tray. So that secures it into place so it doesn't uh, slide out accidentally. And then these four holes are on the back are where you attach the suction cups and you just insert it in the larger hole and then slide it up to lock it into place. Now I also notice that the bird feed tray has numerous holes in it so that will hopefully allow any water that may accumulate in here to drain through, keep your seed dry, prevent it from getting moldy. And uh, there we go. So let's install it on the window, and put some bird feed in there and see what we get. All right, first thing we wanna do is clean our window thoroughly, make sure that it's uh, got no dirt on it so the suction cups will stick. That ought to do it. And then it also doesn't hurt to just to dampen the suction cup a little bit. And then just try to line it up, make it level. There, how hard was that? Next thing I'm gonna do is just put some bird seed in here. Now, it's separated into two separate compartments so you could put maybe sunflower seeds on one side and just a mix on the other. I'm just going to use the same stuff on both sides. We'll just place it in here and that's all there is to it. I like how it's protected from rain just falling straight in. Of course if you have a driving rain it could probably get this wet so if it rains heavily you might have to change your seed out because you don't want it to get wet and stay moldy. But it does have the drainage holes in the bottom so we'll just have to see how that works out in time. So now we just wait and see how long it takes for the birds to discover. Mm -hmm. 